I'm Daniel Baker, and today I'm going to be talking about controversial mascots that people have really seen as racist and offensive in all sorts of different ways. But I'm going to try to I'm going to talk about how they're okay and it's right to keep them how they are. The main problem is most people see them as racist. So usually it's like terms like the Redskins or just Indians in general, like especially Redskins, because they see Indians see that as equivalent to like the N word for black people. I'm not gonna say that. But they just they're just offended by it. And another thing is they're only represented as like warriors. And there's a lot more to Indians than just the killing nature of them. There's also the peaceful ones, the ones that trade, one that make food, and they're really the reason why Americans survived back and whenever we first started coming to America. So the history of the problem. The problem really started whenever sports started, whenever we started having mascots and they needed to find some animal or whatever to use to represent their teams. And so some teams decided to make their mascots Indians and that just made people mad and stuff. And the first case of people getting mad was at Dartmouth College, which is an Ivy League school. And they used to be called the Indians. This is back in the 1960s. They were the Indians. All this crazy stuff happened. And they were forced to change their name from the Indians. Now they're the Big Green. And as, there's a bunch of other schools that have had to do this thing. So the NCAA banned Native American mascots. And just, that's really, it messed up a lot of stuff because some schools got to keep it, some didn't, and it's just a whole really confusing situation. But now, it has been like this for a, a long time, but there are a lot of professional sports teams that people are trying to get changed because of the same reason they see them as racist or offensive. And some of these are the Washington Redskins, the Atlanta Braves, and the Cleveland Indians. So the first reason as to why I think that the mascots are okay and we should keep them is because Native Americans are really important to American history. In a way, they're the reason why America made it. Like they, they were the foundation, the base to our country. And without them, we wouldn't have survived the first 10 years or so of our colonization of this land. And they also supplied us with really anything that we needed, whether when we were at war, they supplied us with weapons, they supplied us with soldiers, food, clothing, really everything that you could imagine, the Indians were there for us anytime that we needed them. Native Americans are a huge part of our country and nobody really gives them credit for what they've done. And just some facts for you. This is a quote by Stephanie Freiberg. Out of, and this was in 2002, out of a report, out of 1,488 TV characters, only 0.4% were Native American, which that's pretty bad. And then 0.2% of newspaper articles featured Native Americans. So the use of Native Americans as our mascots to represent our teams is just a way to show that we respect them and we honor them for what they've done for our country. The third reason is the Native Americans had a really tough mind and a tough spirit, which is exactly what athletes need in order to be successful in sports. So, yeah. <laughs> and sports are really all for fun and people don't really realize that so sports are for fun so the mascots are just for fun too like people overreact over everything but it's not like it really matters because it's really just all for entertainment the fourth reason is that people are just really making this way more big of a problem than it needs to be because it's really not that big of a deal it's such a small issue and in reality the majority of Native Americans aren't even offended uh, a poll that I read online suggests that 84% of Native Americans didn't even care about the mascots, which that's a pretty significant number. 
considering how large of a problem it's become. So it's really the minority of the population is creating a huge problem out of really nothing. So in conclusion, mascots should not be changed and they're fine the way they are. And it's because the Native Americans represent our country and what our athletes need to be mentally, physically, really all of the above. And using them as our mascots is a way to show our respect for them and honor what they have done for our country. Thank you.